detox and let you do that help. So that's what it's about is getting you guys there. No, no, we don't want to detox on going. That's I mean, and that's what and that's what we'll do. That's what we'll do for you. So uh, I heard that for three days. I heard that for three days for three different people. I heard that three different people. No, listen, services are going to be coming down. You, you have my word on it. We will get police services and social services down here. Does she have a phone? You have a phone. That's what she needs. No, listen. I'll tell you what's up. We need to call her. I can lie to you. Yeah, don't take my picture. Yeah, we don't want our pictures taken today, sir. Take mine, you take mine. Do you work for the city? Do you work for the city? Okay, here we work. Don't take my picture. Yeah. I don't want to run the weapon live. If it ends up there, I'm going to find out who you are. I'm going to take my picture. Stop taking our picture, buddy. I got it. Listen, you're going to be good, sir. So, Chief, um, a lot of action going on downtown right now. What's, what's happening here? Uh, so, this is the first step of trying to get some people down here, some of the services they need. So, we want to try to clean up the area here. We noticed there was a lot of litter, a lot of debris. We're going to work with the liquor store and the local businesses here, try to get the area cleaned up. And then in the next coming days and coming weeks, what you'll notice more of, there'll be a lot more social services coming down here, offering, identifying who needs what, and trying to put those wraparound services some of these people in need. We're going to try to really put a, a concerted effort. Not, it's not really, you know, the police are going to be involved, but it's really going to be a, an entire citywide effort to try to offer, try to get these people the, the services they need. Yeah, I noticed the washing the streets and in, in the uh, the doors. Correct. Yeah. So we, we called upon the uh, the fire department helped us out. Just wash the sidewalks off as you see DPIs here with the street sweep, but just trying to get some of the stuff that was washed into the into the curb line to get it off the street. So is there going to be a prohibition on people hanging out as they were? No, before? I wouldn't call it a prohibition. What it's really going to be is trying to get these people the help, they, the services they need. So it's not so much. Is this going to be an ongoing thing? Yes, yes. No, it's not a one-day thing. Like I said, the social service groups will be continuing to come down here and address the concerns of these the people that are in need. You said you can't arrest your way out of this. What did you mean? Well, I just, it's not going to do us any good to come down here and just keep making arrests every single day, just, you know, for whether it's al open alcohol or whatever. Right. We can, but we, we realize the court system, they're going to be right back out the next day. There's people there that need help, with this, whether it's mental health, drug addiction, alcohol addiction, homelessness. So that, that, those are the really the issues that need to be addressed. It's not a, it's not at all a police issue.